Daddy? Yeah? I would really like spaghetti and cheese. Welcome to the Humorous Review, where we're going to see how many days in a row we can post a new video. Please join us. David and I were shopping in the grocery store, and he asked me for some macaroni and cheese, which he calls macaroni on cheese. He wanted the deluxe kind. This made me curious. I wanted to answer the questions, do the different kinds of mac and cheese taste distinctly different? Is one worth more time and effort to prepare? So, David and I set out to cook all three kinds. Microwavable Easy Mac, traditional mac and cheese, and deluxe. Do you want to make three types of macaroni and cheese today? Yeah! <laughs> I'm going to do it right now. <laughs> I'm going to do it right now. I'll eat all these. This one, and this one, and the last one I like is this one. How do they differ in preparation? They're all easy to prepare. Boil water, add the noodles, boil a few minutes, add the flavor packet, and maybe one or two more items. Did you get it? I'm getting it. Good job. I'm getting it. <laughs> I got it. Right here? Yeah. Hold on, you're too heavy. Does that look like the right amount? Yeah, it's not so heavy. Can you shut the door quick? Set the timer, 330. Three, three, zero, and step. Yeah. Step. Step. How is it? Great. Okay, that's enough. Yeah. Okay, one more time. Because four plus four equals what? Eight. <laughs> Very good. Do you like cooking? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> David was a great helper. And he waited patiently when I had to do the more dangerous parts of the cooking. How does each kind taste? The microwavable Easy Mac tastes fine with a strong processed cheese flavor. The traditional mac and cheese tastes the best of all three, probably because it uses real butter and milk. The deluxe mac and cheese ironically tastes the worst. My wife described it as a Velveeta cheesy flavor, but the four cheese sauce tasted heavier and more Romano than normal Velveeta, but I found it unpalatable. It should be said that David loved all three kinds and ate them all vigorously. Okay, sure, yeah, you can try them all. David? David? What? Why did you ask for your own bowl of each kind? Because I like all of them. The winner of the contest? Traditional mac and cheese. The Easy Mac is convenient, and Lucas likes to make these small, good-sized portions for himself. A word of caution, Lucas once forgot to add water before he cooked it in the microwave, and the Easy Mac smoked and burned. The bad smell still lingers. The deluxe mac and cheese is thick, artificial tasting, and I threw it out. Traditional mac and cheese is best, probably because it uses real milk and butter, with fewer artificial ingredients. So, when in doubt, go with the tried and true. Which kind of mac and cheese do you like best? How would you rate them? Please share your comments. Do you have something you'd like us to review? Leave your request in the comments. Tomorrow I'll be reviewing the candy bottle caps from Wonka. If you want us to create new reviews, then please rate, comment, or subscribe on YouTube. Thank you. Okay, David, I, I need to take that away now. No. Can I take it away now? No. Have you had enough? No. I want some more. Daddy? Yeah? I would really like 
Спасибо, Ваня,